The COVID-19 vaccine, a birthday present that simply didn't come soon enough for one dad and doctor. Both of them have really been anxiously waiting for this. Uh, my youngest turned uh, nine in September, and uh, he was hoping that he would actually get the vaccine for his birthday. But now, five to 11-year-olds are eligible to take the COVID-19 vaccine. Dr. Steven Turkovich, the chief medical officer at Oshai Children's Hospital, says his sons were actually excited to take the shot. Because in their mind, this is, the step, this is a step that will allow them to return to normal, potentially not having to use masks in school in the near future. And really importantly is if they were exposed to COVID once they're fully vaccinated, they won't need to quarantine from school. And in their mind, really, they don't want to quarantine from their athletic activities. And the thing that they told me the most excited about is returning to sleepovers with their friends. Dr. Turkovich says protecting his sons was his number one concern, but protecting others was also important. We know the vaccine is safe and effective, and we wanted to protect them from severe COVID, the multisystem inflammatory syndrome, and any potential long-term side effects that COVID can have with kids and up to 7 to 10 percent of them. The vaccine is available at pediatricians offices, county health departments, and pharmacies like CVS. We encourage everybody to use this, the CVS app or go on CVS.com. And if you put in your location, you'll be able to find a store that's closest and most convenient for you that will have it on this initial rollout. And while appointments are encouraged, CVS will also take walk-ins. Do you as a parent feel better that your kids are vaccinated? I do. It's my birthday today. So actually, you know, it's... <laughs> It's, Happy um, birthday! Well, thank you. It, it, to, to me, this is one of the best birthday presents, not only for me, but for my, for my family as well. A birthday present for dad, after all. Olivia Proya, 7 Eyewitness News.